Hey everyone, welcome to The Restaurant Show, and I have the general manager of the Hilton Head Brewing Company, Dana Torres with me. Welcome to the show. Thank you. It's the first time that she's been on, but we have had you guys on before, and you guys have brought some fantastic food that just blew me out of the water. I loved it. <laughs> so I'm so excited to see what you brought me today. Um, and we're actually going to talk about the brewery too, aren't we? Yes. Awesome. Okay. Well, tell us about what you brought today and kind of what's, you know, what, what we have going on today. Well, I brought a couple of our burgers. Since we have some crazy ones on our menu yes. now, I brought our breakfast burger. Okay, and this is the breakfast burger right here. Yes. Now this is something that's offered, um, that is offered on your full menu, right? Yes. And uh, lunch and dinner. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Tell me a little bit about what's on it. It's, um, so it's good. got the American cheese, the bacon, and of course the fried egg on top. I love a good fried egg on oh, a burger. Yeah. I love when all of it like goos out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> and I love your fries. Tell us about your fries again. Uh, well, we hand cut them every day from fresh potatoes and. A lot Fry of work. Up. Yeah. And you have a special seasoning actually that goes on all of your fries, right? Yes, we do our beer bacon rub. And that's this here. This yes. is their beer bacon blend. And um, you have this actually at the restaurant for yes. sale too, right? Mm -hmm. um, this is such a, I mean, I love it. It's so good and just gives a really nice seasoning yeah. to that. All right, great. And then how about this burger? I'm going to kind of switch it up here. This is our ultimate bacon burger. Mm, I see the big, thick pieces of bacon. <laughs> yes, not only do you have bacon on it, but you have a deep fried piece of bacon. It's is that what that well. is? Yes. We oh have deep my fried the bacon and jack cheese and our onion marmalade. On. Gotcha. Okay, so this I was wondering if it was like an onion ring or something like that. Oh no, you you fried the bacon. <laughs> I love it. I would order it and eat that piece first. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. And then that beautiful onion marmalade on there. Good deal. Yes. Now, the brew pub obviously was originally the very first South Carolina brewery, is yes. that correct? But you guys have you guys are expanding and growing. Tell us a little yes. bit about what's going on there. We actually relocated all the brewing equipment mm -hmm. to the brewery down on Cardinal Road. Okay. So and it's a lot bigger. Yes. <laughs> so they have all of the beers made there. Right. They also have twelve beers on tap there and I a tasting it. room. So you can come in, take a tour. Oh, so are they giving the tours already? Yes. You just call and make an appointment. I need to go and check that out. That's yeah. awesome. And now should you, you need to call though and make an appointment for yeah. it? Yeah, especially now since we're canning everything yeah. there. And now let's talk about the cans. And tell me which, tell me, I love the, I love the labels. They're beautiful. Tell me which one, if I'm going to grab both of them, which one of these would you th say go great with the, the burgers? Um, I'd say any of them, but if I was going to have to pair them, I'd put the tropical with the breakfast okay. burger because it's yeah, you know, I love more it. Of a so this is this is a lager that they're that they're doing. Yes. Now is this something that um, you can you'll be carrying obviously at the restaurant? Yes. And then where else can we find this? Um, they will be going in grocery stores, Kroger for one, right? To be exact, love it. That's we right start house. <laughs> distributing all of that to to the okay. different places. A couple restaurants on the island will. That's us. I know. Beers. I'm really excited yes. to have you guys over um, at our restaurant too, and, and featuring some truly, truly local beer. Yeah, Definitely. and we're only canning just the two to start out to yeah. see how well that goes. Absolutely, over. and it'll, and it'll be available on draft also. Yes. Wonderful, but this you'll be able to get in the stores. Okay, so now we're going to move into something else that you guys are offering at the Brew Pub. I'll put this over here and move this over. What are these? They smell so good. These are some of our wings. We have an extensive selection, but mm -hmm. I brought for you are the regular hot, hot wings that you can get right, that right. are the wet. And then I also brought, we have our own rub for buffalo wings. Okay, and that's what this is here. Yes. And this is, um, and this, so you talk fry the wings and then you toss it in this seasoning? Yes. Fantastic. Are they spicy? Um, it has a little bit of spice to it, but right. it's not overwhelming or anything. So the kids could try it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I know a lot of people have people visiting right now and kids love wings and there's always it's always good to have those different options. Yeah, and they're less messy because it's yeah, a dry rub and we have the barbecue <laughs> too. So you could even make your own wings and yeah, come absolutely. by and buy them. And you have this barbecue seasoning too. Yes. And then what do you use this on? Uh, it goes on the wings as well. So instead oh. of having all that messy barbecue sauce, yeah. you get the barbecue flavor. So it's it's like a dry it's a it's a dry rubbed wing. Yes. I love it. I yes. love that. That's awesome. And these three are available also at the store. Yes, we sell these at both places. Great. And then I'm wanting to see this because I'm a big IPA fan. And this is one that you might suggest with the wings oh, yeah. is the IPA. Yeah. And it's a session IPA. No, this one is the regular IPA. Okay, okay, gotcha. Yeah. So but we do have the session on right. tap over there. And just to let you guys know what a session is, um, session is just basically IPAs are very strong usually. Yes. 
um, which I like that. Yes. <laughs> the session you can drink a little more of because it's, it has a little lower alcohol content. Exactly. So it makes it a little bit nicer for summer drinking, yes. I would say, yes. um, or day drinking. Yeah. No. Or anytime drinking. <laughs> Whatever you want to do. If you're on vacation, whichever. Um, so now tell me about um, when you guys are, when are you guys open now? Because I know winter's, winter's a little bit different um, in the, you know, in the food and beverage industry. Um, for summertime, what does it look like your hours are going to be now? 11.30 to 10 we serve food. Mm -hmm. And then of course from 10 to 2 we have our late night. Gotcha. Okay. And then as far as um, uh, reservations or anything like that, do you take reservations? We take reservations for really big parties. Yeah. I'd say 15 or and more. You, and you guys are more than, um, you have we, space. Yeah. Like it's it's a really great spot right in the back there where you can put large parties Oh yeah, we can, we can accommodate big parties. And we also have the outside beer garden open right. now with right. the TVs and the cornhole and the... And that's another thing that definitely, if you have a large party, it's great. Bring the kids, bring yeah. everybody there. Um, and then where are you guys located? For those of you who don't know where you guys are located, can you let us let everyone know? Well, the... Brew Pub is located over on uh, Greenwood Drive, okay. 7C, and then the brewery is on Cardinal Road. Gotcha, and make sure you do make an appointment if you want to check out the great beer that they're brewing. And yes. it, now it's now it's truly the first one on Hilton Head too, right? Yes, yes. <laughs> I love it. Well, thank you so much. Um, I love all the food. I can't wait to dig into those fries. And if, I'll be looking forward to checking out in the local grocer or at any of your favorite restaurants yep. the um, new it is the tropical, the tropical lager, lager and the Indian Pale Ale. Thank you so much, Dana. I appreciate Thank you. it. And we'll be back in just a moment.